Hello friends, welcome to BISP Solutions. Myself Ashwin and I work as a technical consultant at BISP Solutions. BISP Solutions is a tech company and provide technological solutions across the world. Now in this video, this is another video in our integration series. In this video, I'm going to show you how to extract top 10 sales orders information. For example, let's take an example that many times it's a requirement from the client side. The manager wants to see only top 10 remaining, full, uh, re remaining to be fulfilled top 10 open sales order he wants to see. So what do we do here? Again, the same thing. Instead of giving him credentials, we provide him the Excel sheet. And in that Excel sheet, he will hit the button and anytime he can get the information that is the live information, current information in the morning. If he sees, if he hit the button, then at that time, whatever the present scenario that will be presented in the evening, if the manager hit that button, then whatever the current status that will be visible. So for this, we need to do some configurations. First of all, Python should be installed on your system. Whichever system the manager is using, you have to install the Python first. All the necessary libraries should be installed. And then the restlet link should be created. Now here, NetSuite developer will create the restlet link and he will hand over to Python developer. Python developer will connect that API with the Python and then at the button hit the Python link will be called and then by that Python code, Python script will get the data from the NetSuite. So this is the complete process. Let me show you with an example, live example. Now see here, here is the, I am going to delete this and uh, I am going to pull top 10, right? Top 10. Now here is the customized tab. We have given a button to the manager and that manager is going to hit this button. Now, as soon as I hit this button, immediately command prompt will be opened. Now this command prompt is going to call that Python script and that Python script will pull the data from the NetSuite. Now here is top 10. Now it will be visible here. Let's see here. These are the total 10 records, top 10, top 10 sales order recently created. Right now the memo is empty in all 10 uh, sales orders. So that's why it is not showing. Now see here, I have already created a saved search here. In this saved search, you will see, see here, top 10, 1078 Excel and then ivory system and tell us group all these are pulled here see here ivory system and telas group top 10 are pulled here so what is the basic thing is that first of all we pull the data we hit the button and then that excel sheet will call the python code let me show you that python code also first of all let's see here let me open that python code also Just a second. Now see here, this is the Python script. We have already given all data and that Python script is calling the data. Same as everything is as previous. Now what we have done here, here we have created the wristlet link and this link is provided to the Python developer. You will see the link here. This link will be given to the Python developer and with the help of token ID and consumer secret, he will arrange all the data and then he will pull. Now see here what we have done for top 10. Here we have already given start and end points. See here. So get range means 0 to 10. So we need only 0 top 10. So that's why we, we have just written the end point is 10. And all the 10 records are fetched here in this. And we have arranged them automatically. It is arranged first internal ID, then the document number, the amount, and then the customer. So this is how, why this practice is done. Because most of the employees in the company, they are not familiar with technology or, or they need only limited scope. They have only limited scope on the, on the, on the task. So instead of giving them credentials, it is better to provide them Excel sheet with a button 
and this button will fetch the data and this wristlet connectivity is used in every scenario for example one company has given the contact to another company to uh, for for completion of a certain task so they will complete it by uh, in their own software and then they will just uh, transmit the data they will just uh, export the data and that data will be imported into the net suite so there are so many scenarios where this type of exercises are done that is why wristlets are very uh, important so i recommend you to practice this and uh, if you have any doubt then please write down in the comment box i will resolve them and if you are new to this channel please like and subscribe my channel and if you have any doubt you can ask me freely so guys thanks for watching the video thank you goodbye